get Muslims killed. That's right. That's right. That's right. You're calling for the release of Daniel Pearl. You should have been calling for the release of Imam Jamil Alameen. That's right. <laughs> oh, He said he has an office of strategic interest mm -hmm. that he's trying to create specifically for the purpose of misinformation. misinformation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But they had to close it down because it was exposed that they were going to lie all over the earth. Mm -hmm. Trying to tell you that it's always been a department, right. an office of strategic misinformation, the Pentagon itself That's right. yes. is an office of strategic misinformation. Yeah. Lies, spies, and deceit. Yes, sir. But they openly admitted it to you Why? just a few weeks ago that their objective is to lie all over the earth. Yes. Yes. To carry out their interests. What is it all about? It's about seeking the oil. That's right. Come on. It's about seeking the oil right here. Tell you know this for a second. Right here, this black lake right here, the Caspian Sea. Yes. yes. Hold this It's about seeking the oil in the Caspian Sea. That's right. 62 billion barrels of oil in the Caspian Sea. Amen. Three months before the Taliban was bombed, they met with the United States representatives in France. Mm -hmm. And they told them, either you allow us to build this pipeline mm -hmm. over here through Turkmenistan, down through Afghanistan, through Pakistan, through the sea. Mm -hmm. Either you get in on this deal with us and make some money with us. Mm -hmm. Or we will bury you under a carpet of bombs. Check it out. That's what they told the Taliban. Yes, the Taliban was now on a list of terrorists mm. before September 11th. Sure was. Were they? No, sir. No. It's about seeking the oil in the Caspian Sea. Bush is an oil man. That's right. Bush Sr.'s daddy is an oil man. Okay. He got all kind of ties to the oil people in Saudi Arabia and these ties with Enron and these energy companies. These are oil people and they will kill anybody. That's right. Man, woman, child, don't care what who you are, what religion or you are. Right. You get that oil and you get that money. It's about seeking this oil in the Caspian Sea. You talk about a shadow government, Mr. Bush, that will come? Mm. No, there's a shadow government that's always existed. That's right. And that shadow government is corporations and oil companies that dictate U.S. policy. Mm -hmm. U.S. policy is not dictated by you. It's not dictated by the House. It's not dictated by the Congress. Right. U.S. Oil, I mean, part of the U.S. foreign policy. Right. U.S. foreign policy is dictated by oil corporations. And if you don't understand the oil factor, the money factor, and all of this, you will be in the lurk. You will be in the dark. Mm -hmm. They're lying to you about Afghanistan. Yes, sir. They're killing innocent people in Afghanistan. That's right. And they've only really taken, as they told us yesterday, they've only really taken Kabul and uh, what's the city in the south? Kandahar. Uh -huh. Where are the bodies of the Taliban and the Al Qaeda? They say they had a battle, Operation Anaconda. That was a good name. Because it was carried out by a state. That's right. They said they killed 500 Al Qaeda. Mm -hmm. And when it was all over, they could only find eight bodies. <laughs> but they allegedly were bragging and they had to bring the Americans home in body bags. <laughs> but, uh,. They could only find eight Al Qaeda when it was all over with. The brothers and sisters are in the hills. The brothers and sisters are in the mountains. All right. And they're not coming out with the white flag. All right. And this thing in Afghanistan is far from being over with. And you mark, and mark my words, things will be different before the day is over. Because even the Muslim that chooses to side with America, even the Muslim that chooses to side with America, mm -hmm. ultimately the truth that is within that person is going to come to recognize that he's dealing with his enemy. Mm -hmm. yeah. They will turn on them in Afghanistan. Right. Yeah. Let's go on. Saddam Hussein. Mm -hmm. 